Hey there YouTube, welcome back to another new vlog video. In today's vlog, we are taking a flight all the way to the Denizli airport from the Istanbul airport and our bus just left. We're entering the airport. Now, this airport is actually very huge and very beautiful and you can literally just, while you're waiting for your flight, you can tour this airport. This airport is that big. What I really like about this airport is that it has a bunch of different colors. It has blue, red, and it has signboards of blue. And of course, Turkish Airlines, because of the Turkish flag, they have red and white. And there's also the black that is actually from business class, but we are going from economy. So our flight is actually at 6.50 and it's the TK2576 going to Denizli and we haven't... Uh, they haven't told us our gate number yet, but our gate number would be told at 535. Now they've given us our gate info and our gate is actually G10A, it's at, our flight is at 650. Now, if you guys are early and your flight is half an hour later, you guys can have a coffee at Starbucks or you can have some sandwiches at a different, like this little tiny restaurant they have is called Chai Sata, yeah, which means like coffee time. It's right opposite to Starbucks and you can have rice, you can have sandwiches, it's different, they have so much variety of food. Like I said before, while you guys are waiting for a flight or your gate info to be released, you can shop around or you can just tour the airport. So, I really recommend that you guys like window shop because it can keep you busy and you can look at the different things and different items that they have in stock. So, we are on our way to our flight G10A, that's the gate number and there's so many people here that might be going internationally or having domestic flights to other places in Turkey. So our gate was going to open 20 minutes later so here's a little view of what is around our waiting area near our gate. So our gate finally opened and as you guys can see it's gate G10A. And this is the last call for Denizli TK2576. So on the way to our plane, we actually I actually saw this airplane and I really wanted to show you because look at the size of this beast. and five minutes later our plane is moving and we're about to take off now what's really cool is that the seat I got was actually the window seat and it was right next to the wing of the plane so I had a perfect view of what was going on and our plane has taken off wow look at that view that is gorgeous so we are above the clouds and it's very beautiful up here can't like people most people they don't even care about this view but once you actually observe it and look at it it's beautiful so our flight was actually one hour from Istanbul to Denizli and I didn't really do anything except for play game
20 minutes into the flight and they gave us some food or some breakfast they gave me some juice and a sandwich with like cheese and uh, ham now the food was actually very good and it was actually so good that I had to enjoy the view while eating it and we have landed now the landing was actually kind of rough I didn't really enjoy it now I don't really think anyone else like anyone enjoys it but while we were moving towards the airport on in our plane I actually saw this private jet and it looks expensive so we're getting out of the plane and here's a little view of what I saw now this airport is so small that they literally just tell you to walk out of the airplane and walk into the airport but this was actually a very cool view and you could clearly see how big the airplane was there's also some mountains in the distance that you could see and of course you can't you can't miss the airplane itself it's just beautiful and here's the, the nisley airport like i said before this airport is so small now you could like you are waiting for your luggage and your bags and right next to you right next to your window is literally the people who are gonna go back to istanbul i haven't seen a smaller airport in my life now i'm ending the vlog and in the next video i'll be going to pamukkale so make sure you guys turn on notifications and subscribe so that you can be notified when that video will be posted